Hi, I'm Johannes, Product Manager at Deuter, and I'm going to show you all the handy details of our new Avalanche Airbag Backpacks, the Alproof series. The Alproof is the perfect choice for ski touring fans who expect as much from their safety equipment as they do from their own performance. With the Alproof, we've really focused on having the best handling possible, because that's a huge factor when it comes to increased safety. And it's also one reason why we have teamed up with Alpride and decided to use their new and updated electronic Alpride E2 airbag system. Remaining on the surface of an avalanche increases chances of survival. But using an avalanche airbag backpack is no guarantee against total burial. The Alproof comes in a 30 liters L version or a 32 liter regular version. The lightweight Deuter Alpine back system, ergonomic shoulder straps and padded hip fins with a gear loop and ice clipper slot combine to create a compact, snug fit that's really comfortable. The overall effect is that it allows for well-controlled movement in all situations. The waist belt, fully adjustable sternum strap and leg safety strap all work together to prevent the pack from being ripped off in an avalanche. For easy handling, the leg strap is secured without having to undo the waist belt. Speaking of easy handling, there's a separate dedicated avalanche safety compartment at the front, highlighted by an orange zipper with a reinforced shovel sleeve and organizer pockets so that safety gear is quick and easy to access in an emergency. A clamshell opening with full length three-way zipper accommodates the airbag system as well as a 3-liter hydration system. Another special for easy handling is the option of attaching the trigger handle on the right or the left shoulder strap. The other sleeve can then be used to thread a bladder hose and serves as insulation for the hose. To change the side of the trigger handle, open the zipper on the sleeve, unhook the handle, then simply open the burst zipper and pull out the airbag so that you have free access to the openings on the back. Then slide the handle from the shoulder strap through the opening and slide it back through the hole that leads to the other sleeve. Make sure that the cable runs behind the webbing. Now all that is left is to hook the trigger handle to the shoulder strap at the correct height. If you want to use a hydration bladder, open everything the same way as I've shown you for changing sides for the trigger handle, then simply open the velcro behind the airbag compartment and insert the hydration bladder. Now you can push the bladder hose through the free opening until it's at this right height for you. With everything in place, it's now the airbag that must be properly folded and stowed. If you are unsure, watch the video for deploying and packing away the airbag. The zippered pocket on top has two compartments, one for goggles and another with two stowable modular gear straps that can be used to attach skis diagonally across the pack or for strapping a snowboard onto the front. To attach the skis diagonally, hitch the end of the strap without the hook to the lower loop and then do the same thing with the other gear strap onto the bigger loop on top. Then wrap the straps around the skis and thread the lower hook through the loop of the modular gear strap itself. 
and the upper hook through the smaller loop on top of the pack. It's a similar system for attaching a split board. Start the same way with a hitch nut and then run it through the open other loop at the bottom before hooking into the loop of the modular gear strap. At the top, you can thread it through your bindings for extra stability or simply wrap it around the board before hooking into the other loop on top. For ice axis, we have our special ice axe attachments too, with special toggles for easy handling with thick gloves. The new innovative detachable helmet net that connects to the front of the pack has various applications. It's a standalone mesh helmet bag and it's also a helmet flap when attached to the front of the pack. When used like this, the bag can also accommodate other items. The side compression straps are another great feature and can be used to compress the pack down when it's not so full, making the load more stable and compact. Again, this means riders' actions are more controlled, even in challenging terrain. It also means that skis can be attached at the sides in an A-frame. The 30 liter SL version weighs in at 2620 grams and the 32 liter version at 2660, including airbag system. Without the airbag system, the 30 liter SL version weighs in at 1480 grams and the 32 liter version 1520. All L-proof backpacks are TÜV and GS certified. The L-Pride E2 airbag system we've used in the L-proof series is one of the lightest electronic systems on the market. It's unaffected by cold temperatures and it's not currently subject to any restrictions when it comes to travel, shipping or storage. Deploying the very large airbag is extremely fast and super easy thanks to the height adjustable trigger handle on the shoulder strap and practicing or testing the procedure doesn't cost anything and can be done anywhere. Now you've seen how it works, all models in the Airproof series offer the latest airbag technology for reliable protection, easy handling for extra safety and a snug fit for better balance. But any safety equipment has its limitations. Please read the user manual carefully and follow all instructions. Any avalanche, regardless of the equipment you have, is potentially life-threatening. Therefore, an airbag backpack should not encourage you to take greater risks than before. Now you've got all the info, so we wish you a fantastic winter and stay safe out there.